Hey, we are excited about the fall and lots of things that God is doing and lots of opportunities where we're going to see God work. Um, we know it's been a long few months, but we're excited to get back into ministry and get back to what the church is about, which is reaching people and seeing lives changed with the gospel of Christ. And so we got a lot of things I want to just take a few minutes here and highlight what is going on this fall and what there is to get excited about. In the book of Zechariah, it says, Then he said to me, This is the word of the Lord whose word will, not by might nor by power, but by my spirit, says the Lord of hosts. And we want to see God work in our church this fall. We want to see uh, God do great things. We recognize it is not going to be done by our work or by our power. It is going to be done by the Holy Spirit of God as we surrender to Him and as we are faithful to do what He has called us to do. So what are some of these things that are coming up? What are some of these opportunities? The first thing is throughout this fall, uh, we've got a series called Jesus Changed My Life. And what we're doing is we're asking you to come and share your story. Uh, share the story of how Jesus changed your life. We know for many in our church family, it was from addiction to new life in Christ. Um, it was from just, just horrible circumstances and horrible sin and just a life falling apart to newness found in Christ. And we want to take time this fall to celebrate those stories, to be encouraged by those stories, um, and to see how they are used by God to uh, really even bring the gospel to other people in our community. Uh, so we want you to pray about signing up to share your story this fall. And we'll give the details as we go on that. Uh, also, this fall, we're returning with Awana. And this over the last year or two has been a great kids ministry that uh, God has really used in our church, uh, not only to continue to disciple our kids and to bring them up in the faith, but also it's a great opportunity to reach families in our community. So September 16th is that big kickoff for Awana. You can sign up on the website. Uh, hope your kids will be there. They will love it this year. Also in September, on Saturday, September 19th, is a biblical theology workshop for women. And this is led by Nancy Guffrey, a renowned worldwide speaker. And we'd love for all women to come and join. Does not matter what stage of life or age you are. Uh, this is a great chance to come and really focus on what are some of the big storylines of the Bible? What's the big picture of the Bible? What are some of those themes that run throughout the Bible that will help equip you to better be able to read and study and understand your Bible? And then in October, uh, we're hitting it off with a Christ and Culture Sermon Series. Every Sunday in October, we'll be focusing on Christ and the culture and focusing on some big questions like, what does the Bible say about abortion? Uh, what does the Bible say about homosexuality, the LGBTQ movement, and over the last Sunday, talking about orphan care? And Dr. Todd Chipman uh, from Midwestern Baptist Theological Seminary, the author of the book, Until Every Child is Home, Why the Church Can and Must Care for Orphans. He will be here in person that Sunday, uh, preaching to us and speaking to us. We're going to have a big weekend, a big month, talking about Christ and culture. Also in October, on the 24th, is a big trunk or treat. And this will be for all kids. Lots of fun stuff going on. Uh, an event your kids will not want to miss. Also, then we go to November. And what's happening in November? A lot of mission stuff. Uh, we have at our missions conference, how are they to hear the weekend of November 7th and 8th? We'll have missionary partners from around the country here with us in person. I'll uh, we'll have our Saturday night missions banquet, Sunday morning, hearing from our missionaries, them preaching to us, them teaching us. And then this year, something special, we have a special prayer and worship celebration for missions on that Sunday night. More details to come, but you do not want to miss it. Of course, we'll be collecting shoe boxes in November. Excited about that, packing these things up, shipping them all around the world. So I'll be looking out for more information on that. Also looking at some potential mission trips. Um, maybe a trip to Dayton. We've been talking to a church planner there who could use some help. Um, and so we'll be, be seeing what God's doing. Lots of opportunities uh, to get back to mission this fall. We're continuing our One Another series as we wrap out the year. September is confess to one another. October is speak kindly to one another. How, how relevant and timely that is. November is build up one another. That's what we're about as a church, building each other up in the love and knowledge of Christ. And December is welcome one another. So there's lots of awesome opportunities to get involved this fall. Lots of opportunities to see God work and God move in your family and in your life. He is a good God who has great plans. And we're excited to see what is going to happen this fall as we follow him and keep
continue to love him this morning.